Well guys, this is a little embarrassing, but our lady's too fat today, so we're gonna, oh, got one. The line's all picked up right here. Got a nice one. Yeah, we got it that time. Yeah, that's a nice, that's a nice fish. Hey guys, welcome to another video. I'm Chris, this is Kim, and this is the Salty Strikes Fishing Channel. And today we are in Southwest Florida again. We are not in Ponce Inlet, so we are out here in the river and we started seeing some stuff blowing up and we had some other plans, we got some live bait, but we're gonna start off throwing some artificials and seeing what's out here and uh, hopefully get into some fun action. So if you wanna stick around, check it out, stay tuned. Today we're gonna be starting out throwing some little uh, uh, Z-Man paddle tails, about a quarter ounce weight. Kim's gonna have that. And I'm gonna start out with one, two, and see what kind of action we can get into. So I'm just hitting it. There we go, got him. Oh, was it a bl blue fish or something? What do we got here? Oh no, is that, is that a trout? Oh no, they're hitting over here. Get him, baby, get him. Something. Yeah, we just kind of found something blowing up over here. Look like uh, some bluefish or mackerel or something. Uh oh. <laughs> he got it. He hit, he hit it right at the boat when I, right when I stopped. So they're here. Let's just get some. See what's going on here. Hey guys, I was having trouble hooking up with the paddle tails. So I threw on a Uzuri crystal minnow lure and it's just a little three and a half inch with some treble hooks. And hopefully we'll get a couple of these in the boat. We're having a lot of fun. So hopefully uh, we'll have some more action for you. So let's go. Uh oh, there they are, baby. Kimberly's got one. What was that? A little blue, it looked like a bluefish. Get him, babies. Oh, there you go. Got him. Got him. Oh, those ladyfish? I think they're ladies. That's what we got going on here. There you go. <laughs> Hit it right away. Just try to keep him under the water. Oh, just threw it. Oh man, this is fun. <laughs> it's a good way to start the morning. He's getting hit again. There we go. Oh man, he jumped. Oh, you got one? Oh man, they're, they're hitting, but they're letting go quick too. Oh, look, he got, oh, he grabbed him right there at the boat. Oh man, this is this is what fishing's all about, man. This is fun. Look, they're popping all over the place. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. Fly, high flying action. Yep, found some ladies. I may uh, try to keep a couple of these. Try to get a few of these in the boat because they make good bait. Oh, there, oh, I hit it right at the boat, right at the boat. I'm just leaving this camera rolling because it's, they're hitting too fast. For me to turn it off and back on again. Oh, there we go. There we go. Uh, there we go. They're smacking it and they're letting it go. These guys are kind of little, but they're great bait size. Got him, baby? Kimber's got him. Let me get the net, just in case. See if you can see if we can get one of these in the, oh, it just popped. Oh, it, somebody just came back for, oh, it's all, he's all jacked up. <laughs> yeah, straighten him out, all right.
man, this is fun. Oh, oh, oh he hit her. They're hitting it right at the boat, too. I just had one, too. Oh, look, look they're falling. They're, just, they're crushing them, crushing it. Look, I'm just doing this number. Oh, got one. <laughs> got one in the boat. <laughs> oh, sorry, baby. <laughs> Holy crap. We'll throw them in there. I'm gonna do that again. I'm just gonna do some figure eights in the water. All right, guys, I wanna get, take a quick moment to shout out to the sponsor of today's video, Fishbox app. It is a pretty awesome app that's specifically designed for you. When you download this app, it's gonna ask you a bunch of questions. Uh, do you fish freshwater? Do you fish saltwater? Do you like fishing from piers? Do you fish from a boat? Do you fish from, fish from the shoreline? Uh, what kind of bait do you like to use? What kind of depth do you like to fish in? Uh, it's going to throw this thing into an algorithm and spit out some information that's going to hopefully help you be a better fisherman. It's going to show you different fishing spots and it's going to give you information about the, the times of the day and the tides, the weather, everything you need. It's a one-stop shop that'll give you all the information you need to help you out when you're making decisions on when and where, what you're going to fish with. It has fishing knot videos, tips and tricks, artificial versus live bait and all kinds of helpful information. So just go down to the description area, download the Fishbox app, and it'll hopefully help you guys out. So thank you Fishbox for sponsoring this videos, and now we'll get back to some action. Come on. There you go, got him. <laughs> There you go, got him again. That's one way to get some bait. Oh. Are oh, they getting you over there? Oh. Oh look, they're just, they're just, <laughs> they're just smacking it, smacking it. Holy cow, there's so many of them. Oh yeah, it's pulling it off here. You gotta reset it. Yeah, it's getting yanked off. All right guys, so that was a lot of fun. Uh, we got a couple extra baits in the, in the box up there. And we're gonna go back to the original plan. We got some pinfish, we got some tiny, tiny shrimp. Their shrimp are so tiny here this, this time of year. But we still got our artificials. We're gonna head out towards like the Cinebel, uh Pine Island area, and maybe hit some grass flats or some shallow mangrove areas but uh, you have to stick around to find out, so let's get to it. All right, guys, we just uh, crossed under the famous Mat Lache Island uh, bridge, and uh, that's this place took a shellacking in the hurricanes, man. They're still rebuilding. You see a lot of cranes and stuff working over here, but it's nice to see them making a comeback. But I think we're gonna head to like more towards north of Pine Island and see what kind of trouble we can get into there. I am going to throw just a live pinfish out on a little float out here. And I'm also going to free line some pinfish along the mangrove lines here. Something just got him. Something got him, baby. Well guys, we came inside this bay here and we're trying to fish the shallows. And you know, even though I have the, the jack plate on the motor, uh, this girl is a little too fat. You know, it's just a little too shallow around here. It's hard to maneuver. Uh, hit bottom a couple times. 
um, you know, we'll just uh, head back out and try to get some grass flats. Everything's a trade-off. If a boat was skinny like Kim, then we could go wherever we want in these shallows. But, you know, we got a little deeper boat, which, you know, is good for heading offshore and doing inshore. There's always a give and take with every boat. Uh, we thought about getting a bay boat one time, but we passed on it because we love the offshore. So we're going to head back out. But our lady's too fat today, so we're going to keep it moving. Wish us luck, and uh, we're going to go find some fish. Well, guys, <laughs> this is a little embarrassing. We almost ran out of fuel. I think we had more fuel than the gauge was saying, but it got down pretty low. So we made a pit stop over here at Captiva. We went the long way around the island because uh, we wanted to hit some spots over this way. But uh, while we're over here, we're gonna head down, head down here to Blind Pass and see what's up. But yeah, almost ran out of fuel. <laughs> All right, guys, we're over here at the famous Blind Pass. We're over here getting fuel anyway, so we figured make a stop. It's incoming tide. We usually fish not going, but we're gonna throw some pinfish out here and see if we can come up with something fun. Yeah, nice juicy pinfish. Here you go, babies. And just got some fish finder rigs. We got a little three aught mustad inline circle hook, just right through the nose, right under the jaw and out the mouth, and. Just 25 pound liter, a little fish finder rig. And we're just gonna chuck it right out here by these mangroves. There you go. And I'm gonna throw mine right out here too. Got him. Got him maybe? Oh, oh, oh I'm hooked up too. Oh. oh no, he just got both of our lines. Or, oh, got him around the, hopefully he comes around the, oh man, now we're all jacked up. Uh, hold on, hold on. There he is. Alright. Come, 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 get on that side of the boat, baby. Go, go over there, go over there, that way. Go over that way, yep. If you can fight him out. Got him out, baby. Oh, there he goes. He's around the motor, around the motor, come out. Here, you got him, you got him, you got him, you got him. Got him. I'm just, my line's all jacked up right here. Let me get the net. Hold on. Hold on. Let me get the, oh man, that was, that's a nice fish. Oh, there we go. Yeah, man, he just, man, that, 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 that messed up real fast. Holy crap. We got a nice snook here. Yeah, we're locked down. I'm not going nowhere. Man, he just took us for a ride real fast. Got my line tangled and then got tangled up in somebody's other shenanigans over there. And then went underneath the boat. Ooh, that's a nice snook. Here, baby, you want a picture? Come here. He's not gonna bite you, just squeeze hard. Squeeze hard. Oh man, here you go, baby. Sweet. All right, you want me to release him? All right, here, let me push away from the boat here. Here you go, baby. So, he's pretty feisty, so. Oh no. Oh, there he goes. Let me get a scooch us over a little more. Ooh. Good job, baby. All right, it kind of slowed down a little bit over there, so we moved over here. I'm gonna toss it this dock back here, and Kim's gonna hit this dock and see what we can come up with. Got one. Got a nice one. Did he get me in the dock? I think he got me in the dock. No, he's out. Oh, he's out, he's out, he's out. He's coming on this, your side. Yeah, he got caught up all on that dock over there. Yeah, come on, buddy. There you go. Oh, uh, yeah, compared to yours. Good job, baby. Sweet! Another nice little snook. Nice job, baby. Yep. Just getting them on pin fish, little fish finder rigs. Some fun fighting little fish. Little snooky. 
let them go. Whew. And these are uh, catch and release only right now. It's that time of year. Oh, there he goes. All right, well, we each caught a snook, so that was kind of nice. But Kim really wanted to, uh, you know, throw some more paddle tails before we go to lunch. And I think after lunch, we might be calling it. Well, yeah, uh, so we're going to go hit some grass fights like we planned to. This is just a little pit stop, but we'll get out there and get on them. So we made it to the grass flats and Ken's probably just going to throw out the paddle tail. I'm going to throw one last live one out there. Uh oh. <laughs> Yep, I just threw a live one out. Uh, I don't think he's that big, but I just threw a, the pinfish out. What do we got here? Why get my pinfish? Oh yeah, nice tr trout. He's, I'll, I'll just try pop him in. Oh, he may, uh, I'll just see if I can get him. And yeah, first trout. <laughs> I'm just like, you know what else? I'll, I'll sling out one last pinfish out here and Got a nice trout and just using a simple, here I'll show you in just a second, I'll let him go. He's probably too bit small. He's gonna be 15 to 19 and this guy is just 14 and he's hungry so we'll let, they gotta go over there. Run buddy. But I just got a simple little float and just about um, maybe like a two foot leader. Kim's getting hungry so we'll give this one more shot. And hopefully we get something. Oh, Kim's got a nice one. What do you got there? Oh, yeah. Oh, that is that a lady? Still got him. Oh, that's a bluefish. Can you bring him around this way or go that way? Or right, get him underneath. Yeah, I'm just going underneath the boat. Got him, baby. Got him. Ooh, that's a monster bluefish. That was not what we were looking for, but man, we'll take it, right? You want to keep them? No. All right. All right. I'll bring it up here. Ken's got a <laughs> nice bluefish. Probably about a 16 inch bluefish. Sweet. Good job, baby. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Ken says, put it back. Ooh, that was a monster. That was nice. Kim got a little trout. Can you pop him in? Yep, there you go. Good job. Sweet. And that guy hit right at the boat, didn't he? Man, he choked that thing, didn't he? Ooh. Z, let go. Oh, it's in his leg. There he goes. Good job, baby. Sweet. Another nice little trout. There you go. There we go. You got him that time. Yep, you got him that time. Yeah, that's a nice, that's a nice fish. What do we got here on the, got him that time. Probably gonna need the net, baby. What do we got here? Is it another shark? <laughs> no, I don't think so. Oh, yep. <laughs> yeah. Come on this way, buddy. <laughs> this is like a do-over. Yep, another black tip. In the last video, <laughs> same thing. Got a little black tip on a, a little float line back there. Uh, actually, black tips only have black tips on all tips except for this fin down here. And spinner sharks have black tips on all all their fins, which is weird. They should be called black tip sharks, and these should be called spinners. Anyway. But this guy wants to go back, so let him go. There you go, buddy. Woo! All right, that was fun. Hey guys, I think that's gonna wrap things up. 
we're over here at a restaurant. We're going to go have lunch. And then we're going to go back to the, to the pool and play with the rascals. I hope you guys enjoyed the South West Florida edition. I think we're done here. we got one more day here, but I think we're just going to chill out, chill, uh, chill and relax the last day. But uh, we had a lot of crazy stuff going on. The bay didn't work out. It was just a little too shallow for us. But we got on some nice snook and some bluefish and trout and all that fancy stuff. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Because if you did, hit that subscribe button, notification bell, all that fancy jazz. Uh, give this video a big thumbs up because it shows us that you appreciate the content. And we appreciate you guys. And thank you very much. And until we see you next time, guys, stay salty.